Hunter, partner to Mort Lake for the Beef Eater Trophy Hot Top. I've had a unique insight into the Cambridge crew by becoming the first outsider to Cox the Blue Boat. It was a big day for the Barclays Bank 8, whose club play host to the Cambridge crew for the fortnight leading up to Saturday's boat race. Usually, I cox for Barclays, but today, a dream comes true. I'm to be in the Cambridge Blue Boat, a job made more nerve-wracking because the Cambridge coach, Alan Innes, was a renowned Tideway Cox himself. There are opposing conditions. You get entirely different conditions at the start if you get in the middle and get at the finish. So you've got to make sure that you're in the best place uh, at the right time, uh, with the wind and the tide taken into account. Pressures of coxing one of the contestants four days before the big race itself are immense. The crew have hardly been put in good humour by my presence. And in my ears, I can hear the constant buzzing of the pursuing flotilla of launches, one of which carries the nation's rowing correspondence. A critical bunch, especially of Cambridge, because most of them have or have had links with Oxford. But the power of the crew in front of me was impressive. Each stroke rowed jolting me in the back, unlike the more sedate progress of the crews I'm used to. We've got a very good cox this year. Um, we rely on him a great deal and I think he's going to do a good job for us. And what about your crew this year? Uh, we haven't been bothered by illness or bad weather. We've had a, a straight run through. So I think we're as ready as we're ever going to be. We've got uh, three days to go and four days work left to do, so we do it all in the day. Then it was time for Barclays to accompany Cambridge in some three-minute training spurts. And for this second part of the outing, I returned to my normal seat to urge the Barclays crew to greater and controlled effort. Their performance, it must be said, from a little bias, was encouraging. So what did Cambridge Cox Simon Loveridge think of my afternoon's work? It was, it was quite good. Um, obviously it's different um, going into a new boat and um, takes a bit of getting used to. I was certainly having my fair share of difficulties in his um, boat when he went into it. Um, but I was quite impressed with, with how he coped. And how do you see, lastly, the, the race going this year? Do you think it'll be very close? I think or? it will be close. I think um, the crew that uh, applies the cleverest tactics and to non-rowing people, the tactics, what would that be then? Oh, that's for us to know and you to think about. Yeah. <laughs> well, dream come true and uh, talking heads the music there, especially for the Cambridge crew.